Linda Chan, who bakes donuts by day in her family-owned donut shop in Roseville, fell in love with running early in her life and thought that was her way of staying in tip-top shape. But I got bored with it. But um, growing up, I was really out of shape, so it wasn't until like, probably like my 20s when I started kind of getting to know my body a little bit better. And her body was telling her to get into the boxing ring and try your hand at boxing. I just needed something a lot more fun, a lot, just something more gritty, and boxing was it. Finding that grit in the gym seemed to come natural for Linda, who not only wanted a new method of training, but deep down inside, she wanted to truly learn the sport of boxing. I really wanted the challenge, and then I wanted to learn more technique, and I just identified with it. Her newfound identity helped her not only box, but box competitively, where Linda, who makes donuts for a living, has earned a reputation associated with cookies. We called a couple of gals to fight Linda. She fought Ashley Goldstein on the last card, and uh, we tried to get a rematch on that, and we tried a couple other gals, and nobody really wanted to fight Linda. So that tells me that she's a tough cookie, and she's, that's why she's on this card. She also uses boxing to help keep order at home and during her day job. My day job is I'm a mom. I have two boys and my family owns a donut shop. I'm a baker. I work graveyards. Boxing kind of makes or breaks my day. It kind of lets me reset so that um, I can kind of get back in there and get on and take life on because life's a fight itself. <laughs> you know, you kind of feel